Good day, it's day 64. It is uh, Monday. I'm not sure what the date is yet. Uh, I took uh, five hours sick time today, so I'm going into work a little bit later than usual, around 10 a.m. at this time, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. And uh, so I just wanted to jump on here briefly because I got to run into work here um, and and correct something that I put out yesterday involving uh, the pandemic. Uh, I don't want to say movement, but we can say movement, whatever. Um, and uh, I had called for taking the day after, the, the business day after the Labor Day uh, holiday, the weekend, but uh, I thought that through and I know a lot of times companies say if you don't come in the day after um, a vacation or a holiday or whatever that you won't get that holiday pay. So um, I would say let's do the day, this is the second day after uh, the Labor Day weekend. All right, so for all of, again, for the pandemic movement, all right, where we are, excuse me, where we are addressing directly the child support system and the inequity in it, uh, you know, a very real topic, a very substantial, Im substantially impactful uh, system that is feeding on the economy, okay, finances, and uh, energy of men. And I contend in a gross, uh, grossly unjust way, all right? I'm not, I'm not calling for the end of child support per se. I'm just uh, saying that there are some things that need to be revi re revised. Uh, I do, I do, I do believe that it is necessary for uh, some form of government. I do believe it is necessary for uh, agencies like child support. Uh, but I, I contend that it, it, it has not been checked. The powers have not been checked, and when power goes unchecked, then you have uh, all kinds of corruption and sedition and ty tyranny and what have you. And until the people, the way that our system works in closing is uh, until the people. Uh, make the difference or uh, cry for the change, uh, the government is a system, a, ma a machine. It's just going to continue until you use the political processes or um, until you use, um, you know, your right to protest or whatever, constitutional right to protect, constitutionally protected right to protest. Until you do that, everything will stay as is. And that's the way our system is designed to work. That's called the political uh, system, all right? And so with that being said, we need to get active on this. If you are affected negatively by the child support system, then you better make sure that your voice is heard. And we're not calling for any drastic measures or um, any radicalism. That is unnecessary, all right? The political process works if you know how to use it. And uh, it is said that he or she that does not know their rights has none. So, question is, do you know your rights? Uh, uh, secondarily, uh, do you feel that your rights are being violated in some sort of way? Your, your, your. Uh, first of all, your political and civil rights, and most, more importantly, your human rights. All right, which you have certain inalienable natural rights that uh, you don't need per se statutes, codes, ordinances, or even the Constitution per se. These existed. Uh, in the area uh, previous uh, to any of that, all right? Men established the state. The state did not establish men. Men established the government. The government did not establish uh, men and women, okay? So with that being said, it's time to get active on this. We can make change. The way that we are going to do this is we are going to make sure that our voice as men, as some women, and uh, the communities at, at large, we're going to make sure that, that they hear us, they Whoever you want to categorize, whoever you want to fit in that category, all right? I'm not going to be specific on that because we're not really targeting, uh, you know, at least unjustly uh, uh, one specific uh, person, but we're, we're, we're um, wanting to be heard by this particular mechanism, okay, which is child support, okay, and the enforcement thereof. Some things need to change. Not everything needs to go away, but some things definitely need to change. 
Uh, if you are a hundred thousand dollars and and uh, you know how long you're never going to pay that back. Plus, they uh, uh, you incur interest and all of those things. Plus R and D fees. Uh, you know, plus you lose your driver's license, so it, it messes with your economy. That should not be something that happens. Why would they take away your driver's license to force you to support your child when you need your driver's license, okay, in order to support your child and the children that you may have in your home, okay? So, <clears throat> just a, just a, that, and, and the list goes on and on, okay? I don't have time right now to go into those details, but we will be talking about this more. Get on board. Don't be silent. Uh, don't just sit back and complain. We're going to simply do this by taking days off of work, legitimately taking vacation and, and or sick days. And that is how we're going to be heard, because when they see the effect or the effectivity and the the influence that men like us have on the system or on, you know, uh, on in, in industries and what have you around the world and around the country, uh, then they will perk up their ears. Why is this happening? Why are all these people taking off? Okay, and they're peaceful, so it's not nothing. You know, nothing again, nothing radical. Just exercising your right to take a day off, but we do it collaboratively. All right, in unity, and that's going to make all the difference. And I assure you, we will be heard, and I assure you that change will happen almost overnight. All right, if you believe that men are the backbone of society, uh, of societies then you know what I'm talking about, all right? With that being said, let's unify, let's come together, let's have this discussion. Um, we're gonna set the second day after the Labor Day weekend, I mean, the first weekend of uh, September, I believe that, that first weekend is Labor Day, so the, not the first day after, but the second day, business day after, uh, plan to take off, take a vacation or a sick day, um, and uh, let's do this. Let's stick together. Let's be heard and let's make these changes. All right. We need to discuss what it is we are wanting out of this. What do we want changed? There's some intelligent minds out here that has, have been thinking this through. All right. And that have a plan, an alter, alternative plan to what is in, in existence right now to fix this issue. All right. With that being said, make it a great day. I'll talk to you on the next upload. All right. And be heard. All right. Look for the Facebook page I'm going to be creating hopefully today. It'll be called Mandemic, Mandemic. It may be Mandemic 2024, I don't know, but definitely Mandemic, like pandemic, but Mandemic. All right, we'll talk to you soon, peace.